The debate between U.S. presidential candidates Kamala Harris and Donald Trump featured some tense exchanges on foreign policy. And it was being closely watched around the world for signs of how each of the rivals might act in the White House. The Kremlin claimed to have been irked by all mentions of Russian President Vladimir Putin in the debate. Putin's name is used as one of the instruments for the internal battle in the U.S., spokesman Dmitry Peskov told me. We don't like this. Last week, Putin claimed he was backing Harris in the election and praised her, infectious laugh. Later a Russian state TV anchor clarified that Putin had been, slightly ironic. Kamala Harris has no track record on China and on the debate stage she simply repeated her line that the US, not China, would win the competition for the 21st century. The vice president represents something China does not like. Uncertainty. For Chinese leaders. This debate will have done little to assuage beliefs that Trump represents something else they don't like. Unpredictability. Trump showered praise on the Hungarian prime minister, Viktor Orban. One of the most respected men, they call him a strong man. Hungary's pro-government Magyar Nemze ran the headline, Huge Recognition. But government critical news portal 444 quoted Tim Walls, running mate of Harris. He, Trump, was asked to name one world leader who was with him, and he said Auburn. Dear God, that's all we need to know.